You've probably heard of people collecting old vintages of wine, but did you know some people also collect old corkscrews? They'll pay thousands of dollars for an antique. In our Wine Insider, we take a peek into the little known world of collectible antique corkscrews. A lot of people walk by and say, my goodness, I've never seen so many corkscrews. Most people are pretty surprised. It's just not something you'll see. They say to look for your niche in life. It seems Dean Walters has found his. He's an antique dealer with a twist. Out of all the different things that I brought to the market, corkscrews became the most popular. Dean's stock in trade is antique corkscrews. Some hundreds of years old, some worth thousands of dollars, and a select few still usable today. This corkscrew is the first significant mechanical patent. It's an English patent uh, designed by Sir Edward Thomason in 1802. It's going to sit on top of the bottle, and the first thing we'll do is insert the corkscrew with a little bit of uh, downward pressure. This is a fundamental example of the Thomason, uh, starts in the range of uh, $500. Some of Dean's pieces may look like run-of-the-mill corkscrews, but they are anything but ordinary. This is a very significant uh, American design, um, the first important American patent. It uh, represents the beginning of American mechanical design. The significance of this mechanical design creates quite a bit of desirability and value, consequently. About seven years ago, Christie's Auction House in London sold one for nearly $20,000. But a corkscrew needn't be all that old to fetch a high price. These are examples of mid-20th century corkscrews that were created as novelties by the uh, Syracuse Ornamental Company, commonly known as Sirocco. There's a monk, a clown, Indian, and knight. Uh, the knight being the most uh, valuable of these uh, corkscrews, uh, actually sells uh, for over $3,000. Although it may be hard to imagine spending thousands of dollars, antique corkscrews have become so popular, clubs have formed for collectors. It becomes uh, almost a disease, you know, you really can't uh, stop once you've started. It, it's, it's usually a lifetime pursuit. It seems old-time corkscrews can provide a lifetime of entertainment. That's the mania of collecting. Kind of gets in your blood. 